Um, hey everyone, it's Pickle. We're here with another Skyrim video. What a la la. And, um, uh, <laughs> um, this is, um, actually something I found out. Um, it's how to convert anything, anything made out of ebony. How to convert it into a Daedric. Like, um, ebony swords, ebony bows, ebony armor, shield. Daggers, battle axes, war hammers, stuff, anything. So, um, I have a Daedric bow, which was an ebony bow, Daedric sword, which is an ebony sword, and, uh, oh, um, Daedric gauntlets, which were ebony gauntlets. And I would have had ebony boots as well, but, um, there's there is a glitch. It's really weird. I don't know why. But for the boots, you cannot do this with the boots. It will on the thing here. I'll, I'll explain it when I get there. And the reason I haven't done it on um, the mission, the quest you have to do that automatically gives you a full set of ebony gear except for a helmet. Um, it comes with a special enchantment on the chest plate that you cannot remove. And um, it's really good, anyways. It's like um. Any enemy in a certain vicinity of you will take 10 damage per second, which is awesome. So, um, basically what you want to do to get there, um, you need to go to the College of Winterhold, Winterhold which is up in, um, Winterhold, College of Winterhold right here. So you want to fast travel here or come here if you haven't gone already, and you just want to come up. Now, when you walk into this main central outdoors court field thing, you want to take a left and then run along in the pillar roof thing and you will find this trap door to this place called the midden you want to go in there and um the midden is kind of like i i don't know what you'd call it like what like a backstory behind it like why it's here or anything it's just it's like an underground cave thing so i mean you know i mean they, they don't like i don't think they give like any hints about the midden at all like oh um, I'm supposed okay so basically just follow my lead okay so you come down from this ladder up here and I'm so bad at doing these but you come down from this ladder and just go where I go you walk through the tunnels and you might see a red enemy indicator don't worry about that you want to go down the stairs and go to the the store uh, straight ahead then turn left and go down the stairs and then go through these Take this right tunnel, go through here, and keep going, and then ta-da, you're here. Wait, what's this? Nothing. Okay. <laughs> so um, this this red thing, that's not there. That's not always there. That is um, that's the sigil stone. You have to do a mission for a guy. You have to have um your conjuration to get the mission. Your conjuration has to be level 90. Which I actually took my conjuration from 20 to 90 with this method. It took like 30, 40 minutes. I'll make a video about that. Truly, really, really easy. And then afterwards, you can start the mission, do it, and get a sigil stone. And then you place it here. So, um, basically, what you do, there's this um, offering box and then the pull bar. So, you open the box. Now, you need to take whatever ebony thing you want to turn into a daedric which in this case i'm doing a shield ebony shield um there so we put you put the item in see shows up in the offering box then you need one daedra heart um i'm probably going to make a video on how to showing how to farm daedra hearts um really really simple um i mean you kill, I think, one time running running the farm, you get four hearts. Yeah, two dangerous outside the thing go in the cave. There are two more in there. So you want to put in one danger heart. One danger heart. Make sure you don't eat it while you're in, instead of putting it in because I've done that and it's not very fun. And then you need a black soul gem, which is pretty, pretty rare. I had more. Um, I'm going to try to find some way to like an easier way to find them and then I will share that with you so um put one black soul gem in and then the last thing you need is a, is a centurion dynamo core 
So there are multiple locations you can go to find these. They're the Stormer. Um, you kill the big Centurion dudes, the really huge ones. Or um, you have a chance of getting one as a drop from a, um, a sphere. One of the uh, Dwemer spheres. Whatever, I, whatever they're called. But the dudes, they roll out as like a ball and then they like... Blah, 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 and they're like a Transformer. They're like Transformers, robots in disguise. Like that. And then they like try to kill you and stuff. They have like... Blah, 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 and all that. So... You have a chance to get anyone from there, or you can find one in a uh, in the chest. So then put one in there. Okay. So let's make sure we have everything. So ebony shield, black soul gem, centurion dynamo core, danger heart. Okay, that's all you need. And then you pull, and then that happens. And then would you look at that? And this is not a glitch. It's see, daedric shield. Now um, now what happens? The, the glitch that happens with the um that happens with the uh it's really weird glitch that happens with the the um uh, blah, 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 if I can remember uh, blah, 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 the boots they um uh the, the glitch that happens with the boots it you'll put the ebony boots in and stuff and it will take the stuff from the search box I mean from the uh, offering box so make sure you save before you put the stuff in and then it would it would do that purple effect and then it show up on the ground but when you pick it up it would they disappear from the ground but they wouldn't be in your inventory they wouldn't be anywhere on you it wouldn't be anywhere near you and my the thing is with uh s s things with ebony like the ebony chest plate i have which you get from the mission um that is a special enchantment that you cannot take off so and um i mean if you could take it off i would take it off Make the make it into a daedric chest plate and then put the enchantment back on the daedric. But can't do that. So you need that sigil stone. You got this sick looking shield. Looks pretty pretty sexy. And got my sword. Got my daedric gauntlets and my Croesus hat. The I mean helmet mask thing uh, from one of the dragon priests and an ebony chest plate and boots and a. I look I look derp man like in the coolest way possible yeah 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 thank you guys for watching this uh Skyrim does she have marks on her oh that's like lighting okay I was like no nah, never nah, like like, like not nah, nah, never noticed never noticed that before so I'm uh yeah thanks for watching this uh Skyrim video um tell me what tutorials you want to see um I already did one on how to get a companion, how, how to get the uh, bandy companion. Um, go check that out if you haven't watched it already. If you're in need of a companion, um, I always say like thank you for what I say it at least five times at the end of a video, and then I'll start saying something else. Get used to it, okay? So, <laughs> so, okay. Last time. Thanks for watching the Skyrim video. Tell me what you want to see next. Like, favor, subscribe, um, all that. Share it on stuff. And um, yeah, I will uh, see you all next time.